Uh, behind me is a die plot of our newest processor. It's got a brand new architecture that is codenamed Isaiah. The architecture is revolutionary because we've been able to double the performance of our current parts through architecture but keeping the power the same. And that is, you know, on the surface sort of impossible. <laughs> and to, to do that, what we had to do is invent a total new architecture that has hundreds if not thousands of detailed trade-offs or design decisions that we had to make very carefully in order to get the best performance per watt, which is what this processor really does. This processor is focused on the mobile marketplace, which there's all varieties from notebooks, down to little notebooks, down to ultra-mobile PCs, down to internet, uh, mobile internet devices, to all kinds of handheld things. In all of those environments, power consumption is a necessary. You, I mean, you have to have good power consumption or you can't live because it's battery powered. So the trick is, how do you get your battery consumption low but provide the performance that modern applications need? Now, we currently have a C7 product line that has the lowest power of any product out there and good performance. Good enough, it actually has quite a few design wins. What we tried to do with the new Isaiah architecture is to double the performance at the same power. So for people that wanted more performance than our current products offer, they could get that performance, but they wouldn't have to give up any, they wouldn't need bigger batteries, they wouldn't have to give up power supply, and get, I mean, give up uh, battery life or anything else. The other thing we did is we make the new part perfectly compatible, pin and package compatible with our current part, so one board can support both. What this approach means to designers is that they can build one pro product design, one board, one package, uh, you know, shell that can have two different price performance points. One is the current C7 price performance point, and with no extra work from them, they can offer something with two times their performance. If I could draw a little plot here of performance and power, there's the competition, and here is our C7. Rumor has it that the competition is developing a new architecture aimed at the, kind of the design space that we're in. The rumor has it that it will be low power but not, not particularly good performance, maybe not any better than our current part. What we've, uh, and more importantly, it's totally incompatible with the higher end version of that competitor. That is, they, these two product lines don't use the same chipset. They don't use the same board, they don't use the same package, you know, different buses. So you just have this, this division. What we've done, back to my picture, competition here, uh, C7 here, is at the same power, we've just moved performance up. With a perfectly compatible line, same bus, same package, same, same board, right? <laughs>We initially started out as a chipset company. In the last two or three years, we've been transitioning more to becoming a, a CPU platforms company. And I think with Isaiah, that cements this process and takes us to the next level in terms of performance, in terms of product, and the kind of product line that we can offer.